I spoke to Oscar, that's my son who was starting prep here, and he was talking about how mathematics was something that we just do at school. And so we had this discussion that night talking about actually we're surrounded by mathematics. Mathematics is everywhere. So I spoke about, well, could we possibly um, do a program that involved us taking our mathematics to the streets of Belgrade? And that's exactly what the program's all about. So we're just on the local strip, we get out there and we do a whole range of activities. It's whatever mathematic activities they're looking at or they're focusing on in the classroom. So for example, if they're looking at subtraction, I'll design a maths on the move session about subtraction. If we're looking at three-dimensional shapes, we'll go into a 3D shape treasure hunt. Um, so it's all about whatever's happening. So it's that connection between classroom and then real life. So we're about building that spark and encouraging kids to see mathematics as a real life skill and that's not just something in textbooks or something that you do while you're sitting at your desk. The teachers at our school felt that there was a real need to bring parents in to educate people about, well, what is mathematics today? What does contemporary mathematics look like? Pre-discussion with parents is really important so we get to talk about what are we going to focus on? possible vocabulary that we might use. We discuss what are the key concepts of prep or grade one or grade two. These are the things you can do at home. So this is all in the discussion that I have 10 minutes before we actually go out and do the mathematics. So usually it works that there's one parent and a group of three children. So there's that collaboration that you get and the swapping of ideas. We've had a huge turnout at each Maths on the Move session. Parents are very much interested in what contemporary mathematics look like and how can I help my child. Parents are listening to the children report back and hearing their learnings and their wanderings and their findings. If a parent comes, their child is the reporter. So it's through that collaboration and that partnership that we can help children have a better understanding about mathematics and then we can work together to improve and build that spike in mathematics. What we have noticed through Maths on the Move around town is the children's engagement lifted in mathematics. When they were outside, they were more active and actively involved in mathematics and they wanted to question things and find out answers. And lots of teamwork was happening there and discussions, informal discussions. So we have lots of observations of these students being engaged in their learning. I was really impressed. I was really taken by how um, involved and engaged the kids were and how excited they were. Yeah, and I just thought yeah. it was really great to, for them to see how maths impacts on everyday life. I think it's fantastic and you can see the progression in the kids over the three years, how yeah. they've gone from not being able to recognise things to being really confident. Yeah. And Charlotte's gone from not liking mathematics <laughs> to yeah. the other day. She said, I love maths. Yes! So, <laughs> it's, been, it's been really good for her. I think I've got a better at knowing my 3D objects. So you get to see that there's maths everywhere you go. You're going to move around and do lots of maths and you know there's maths everywhere, everywhere around here.